Eric here with Maco Tools. Today we're going to show you how to register and update your Max 3. Welcome. Let's register and update your Max 3. The first thing you want to do is check to make sure you're connected to Wi Fi up in the top right corner. There's a little Wi Fi symbol that will let you know if you're connected or not. If you're not connected to Wi Fi and you need help, you can visit www.maximus3.com for a video that will give you the step-by-step -step process on how to connect your Max 3 to Wi-Fi. If you need further assistance, you see up here in the top right corner, there's a MACO dedicated uh, 877 number for assistance in any of these things that you would like to do. So let's get started here. Um, we're gonna, I've made it a little easier here with a little cursor so you can follow me where I'm going. So we're gonna go down to these icons across the bottom of the tool here and we're gonna um, Go to the little house icon. Um, we're going to click that house icon, and on the uh, Android home page, you're going to see um, a wireless update icon or app. We're going to check that. It's going to tell you there's a new version available, and we're going to download that version. We're going to click install now. Okay. It's going to go through some updating. It could take about a minute or so. So we'll speed up the process to better suit the video. Okay, so once you successfully updated the Android operating system, uh, your tablet will go through a reboot and it will bring you back to this page. So now you're ready to update and register your Max 3. So we're going to click register unit and it's going to bring us to an easy a uh, couple dialog boxes to fill out, username, choose a password, enter an email, uh, verification code and activation code, and we'll explain how you get these. So let's add our name. First name, last name, email address. Choose a password, verify your password. Okay, so the serial number of the unit can be found on the back of the unit or it can be found in a little white card that comes in the packaging with the M3. Uh, product serial number will be on the front cover and uh, we'll get to the verification code. So enter the serial number. verification code will be inside the little white package that comes in with the M3. So you have to peel the edges off and then open it up and then you'll see a number hidden underneath that we call the verification code. The activation code will be received at the date of purchase on the receipt from your Maco Tools distributor. Uh, it will be a, some letters and numbers um, called an activation code only given to you by the distributor at the day of purchase. So you enter those letters and numbers and you put your postal code and at that now once you successfully activated your M3 you can see now it says run diagnostics. So at this point, you click run diagnostics and it will bring you into the scan tool. Log in successfully. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna update our software. So we're gonna pull in whatever the most current software is the day of registration. So how we do that is we go up to the little icon that looks like a toolbox, okay, up here and we click that. That's gonna bring us to our toolbox section which we'll explain more in depth in another video on, uh, Mac, on the Maco Tools website. Okay, so for sake of updating, now we're gonna go down, down to the bottom left icon here that says update, and we're gonna click that. Now what we're gonna do is it's gonna pull in all the current updates that are avail available for the M3. And it's as simple as just clicking update, and depending on your Wi-Fi, this is 
quick as the service will be. Okay, now once it's done installing the most current software, it's going to ask you to install manually. It'll take a couple minutes to install the app. Click done. And now you're ready to run diagnostics and start diagnosing cars. Good luck.